Let's turn to the Supreme Court battle still. The president tweeting overnight, the Supreme Court is one of the main reasons I got elected president. I hope Republican voters and others are watching and studying the Democrats' playbook. He is now also closely monitoring breaking developments overnight in North Korea. Kim Jong-un making new promises of denuclearization during a summit between the North and the South. The president calling the news very exciting. Let's bring in Chief White House Correspondent John Carl at the White House. John, so far a few details on how exactly the North will denuclearize nuclearize. There are few details, Cecilia, but this does look like a significant development. The North Koreans have agreed to dismantle a, new, a, a missile test facility and most importantly have agreed to do that in the presence of international inspectors. And in a vivid display of the thaw between North and South Korea, the two Korean leaders say they will submit a joint bid to host, co-host the, the 2032 Olympics. Uh, and. They say Kim Jong-un has said that he will visit Seoul. No North Korean leader has ever done that. In terms of denuclearization, the North Koreans are also saying they will dismantle a nuclear test facility, but they are demanding reciprocal uh, measures by the United States. It's unclear what that means. So the bottom line here, uh, that we are a long, long way from denuclearization, but this does look like a step in the right direction. Okay, John, one other quick headline. The president also heads to the disaster zone today to survey the damage from Hurricane Florence. He's going to visit a Marine Corps base near Wilmington. Uh, he, I expect he'll do an aerial tour of the damage and meet with some victims, uh, getting a firsthand uh, a look at the damage down there. John Carl at the White House, thank you. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.